What's up, YouTubers? This is your boy KJV17 back again. And today is something new, but no, not for me. Because, you know, I'm a do it yourself -er, and I like to do stuff like that. <laughs> this is a D, uh, uh, DIY. DIY. <laughs> but anyway, uh, the engine light came on in the car just a, a couple days ago. And, um, you know, you can go get your stuff tested for free to get a code, uh, get the code so you can see like what's wrong with it because you don't want to take it to get it serviced and you don't know what in the world because they're just, hey, I've been in a situation where they try to throw some stuff on you, but me being me, I know a little bit about cars because of my uncle. And so I know a little bit of stuff and I always get stuff checked out before I take it. And uh, they actually try to throw some stuff on you, so you know, they're just trying to get, a, get, get some money from you, but got my little thing here. It's a scanner reader thing. I got it from Amazon. Read up on it. And the reviews are pretty great. I don't think I can tear it on. Should have got some seals or something. It's getting weak, man. I'm an old way. We just put a little strength on it. There you go. Mm, package. Pretty good, I guess. It's called a uh, V Peak, and uh, it's an OBD check system thing. It's supposed to be able to go with any cars from like year 2006 and on up. And so um, I'm going to check it out. Uh, all I have to do is uh, go plug it into the system. Uh, by the instructions that I read online, it actually says that you can take this and plug it in. You don't need any power or anything because it's powered by the car. You go plug it in the plug while the car is off and then you turn your car on and it'll give you the readings and you'll be able to get the codes. I believe you get like a generic code and also a factory code. And uh, I'm going to get a wifey to feel me doing that right now. But right now, this is just uh, how it is. And, uh, yeah, she's going to feel me doing that right now. She's shaking her head now. But she's going to feel me doing that so you can just see and I want to verify that it does work. Like I said, it's an OBD uh, check system. Uh, system. Uh, I think I got it for like $21.99. It ain't bad at all because I've seen some out there that cost anywhere from $50 on up. Uh, they also got some that uh, is around the same price. It's supposed to be like Bluetooth. Uh, you can hook it up to your Android phone, but uh, I think it's Android phones only. But if you got uh, the money, just get one that has the full features and uh, functions is anyone like you would go to like a uh, auto zone or uh, someplace like that advanced auto parts but, but like i said this is a vp uh obd2 scan tool so i'm going to be checking this out and see how good it is peace all right you too with this your boy back again with the vp um obd uh scanner so I'm gonna hook it up to the car. As you know, we got a uh, cruise. Uh, it's a 2012. Uh, been a good car. Ain't never had no problems with it. And uh, just the engine light finally came on with it's almost six years at the end of uh, October. So a uh, little plug is down here under the dash where well, it should be. And so all you have to do is plug it in, you get power from this. Make sure I had to put my glass on so I can see. Flip it up. It may not look like it's gonna go in, but it's just a little simple. I just gotta get it to stay in there. I'm gonna cut that out. As you can see, it's up and going. You see that good? Pretty good uh screen right here so in order for me to check a code which you can already see is in English you can go through it I guess you can go through it now it's got some simple instructions I wanted to set it up so I hit the down button and probably go through a whole bunch of stuff but I can show you that right now if you want to it says language you can already see it's in uh, English you need a measure let's check it out see what that says it just saying English or metric so I'll hit an enter so they keep it in metric I mean, I guess contrast would just be far as your screen, click down, which is a good for me. Then I scroll on down to exit. Pretty simple to follow. And I 
hit a uh, enter to do that. So I want to uh, scan the car. Let me cut the engine on. See if the light's still is on. And yes, it is. So what I would do here is just hit enter for the scan. Uh, it's going through there right now. It's hit cold brown one. Monitors uh, three. Read the code. I hit enter to read the code. No codes are stored in the module. Press any key to continue. So it's not showing me any codes. So you're seeing one of six. System to the main. So the code here is PO171. Uh, so what I have to do is go uh, look up this code right here and see what that is. But I know the P probably stands for powertrain usually and things like that. It's just because I learned that from my uncle. And uh, when I look at this code, let me remember that. PO171. So that's it for right now. You see that it works. Like I said, it's just $21.99 uh, Amazon VP and uh, pretty good. So uh, that's it for right now. And what I'm going to do, uh, go look up this code and then I'll take it to the shop. And so that's why I said for those who like to do it yourself, like you can go get this uh, test done from uh, like AutoZone and stuff for free. But then like you can go take it to a, a service shop. They'll charge you anywhere from like 100 80 to 100 bucks just to do this same little simple thing right here. So, if you got uh, 21 bucks, I think it's a good investment, but do it yourself with like me and you. Till next time, peace, love, and That boy's good. If you like this video, hit that subscribe button to stay updated with Fitz Life 5 and my daddy's beats. Until next time, peace, love, and hair grease.